Trilogy describes their offices as little honeycombs, so that's why they are quite literally breaking down the walls, expanding their services, so that Chicago's South Side is no longer a mental health desert. Three, two, one, go! The walls here at Trilogy are coming down, so more patients like Keith Fields can have a fighting chance. It's not them helping you get your track back on life, it's them giving you the opportunity to figure out the reason why you're in the situation. Field says he was formerly incarcerated and he used to be afraid of walking through these doors until he understood that help was necessary. But at this point in our life, it's critical. According to a study done by the Journal of Racial and Ethnic Health Disparities, suicides have increased for black young adults. The study shows nearly 80% of black women and more than 76 of black men surveyed said they felt hopeless about their future. What I see is a beacon of hope. We don't have enough of this. Uh, this building at one point was nothing. What we hope to accomplish in this building is a place where people can go before they end up in jail. It's why Trilogy purchased the 24,000 square foot building in Chicago's Chapman neighborhood, which has higher rates of anxiety, depression and PTSD. They say more renovations are on the way. We have additional space that we can grow into to take on more services and more individuals, providing them the necessary mental health platform that they need to be well in our community. Don't be afraid anymore. Fight for yourself. They say they are looking to raise $1.5 million. If you would like to support their cause, we'll have all that information on our website at abc7chicago.com. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.